On the last episode of Hood Toxicity, Ruthless found out that Miami, Naomi, Sean, Tay, and Michael were all in a car accident. Sean ended up dying in that car accident. Ruthless told the girls and her brother about it. Two months later, Ruthless and the girls were planning on buying a new house. When Andrea was about to show them the house, Michael and his friends ended up getting into their house. He got them and started torturing them. One day later, Owen noticed that Ruthless didn't answer any of his calls or texts, so he checked the cameras and noticed that something was out of place. He pulled up at Ruthless's house and found out that Michael and his friends were torturing Maya, Andrea, and Ruthless. Owen's friends ended up killing Michael's friends, and Owen ended up killing Michael. One month later, Owen was charged with Michael's death and Ruthless had her baby. After Ruthless had her baby, everything went downhill. Ruthless ended up passing away right after she gave birth. She had her beautiful baby girl, but sadly, she never got to meet her. Andrea and Maya take care of her now. Her name is Camilla, meaning perfect. She is a perfect, healthy baby. She is now three years old, living with Andrea and Maya. They finally moved out of the old house and they live in a bigger and better place. Maya was able to start working at a beauty salon, something she has always wanted to do. She loves her job so much and the best part is when Camilla and Andrea come to visit her. Andrea stays home and watches Camilla most of the time. For Miami, Naomi, and Tay on the other hand, they have all separated and stopped talking to each other. Once Miami's brother died, she had a hard time, so she cut Tay and Naomi completely out of her life. She is going through very bad depression and is doing therapy because of it. She lost the person who cared about her the most and who was always there. Naomi ended up moving to Texas to finish school. She works very hard and she lives alone in an apartment. Her and Tay sometimes text, but they don't talk very much. Tay moved back to the hood where all his people were. He lost his closest friends, especially Sean. He ended up becoming a drug dealer, and that's how he makes his money and how he lived the rest of his life. Everyone is grieving from all the losses. Maya and Andrea lost Kim and Ruthless just a few months apart. Miami, Tay, and Naomi also lost Sean and Michael just a few months apart. Hopefully they can leave all the negativity in the past and just forgive and forget.